Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, put your hands together for the master of disaster and the chainsaw champion of Royal Oak, Michigan, Bruce Campbell! <laughs> Tonight, I could read, but there's a kid over there who wants to get out of here. <laughs> and we're going to let him get out of here. So we can go right to your, your needful questions, the ones that you have to have answered now, immediately, while you record this conversation. <laughs> My God. Look at God, look at me. I'm seeing a sea of cameras. What are you getting? <laughs> Nothing, because you're not paying attention. <laughs> no. So, who's got to know what? Yeah, right there, right there. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. When is, when is uh, Ash going to get some sugar? When is Ash going to get some sugar? Uh, February 25th on Star's Mother's Scratch Yeah. Yeah, yeah, clap, clap, clap. You're getting that too? Who has the Star's app? Raise your hand. Right. Four fifths of you can kiss my ass. <laughs> oh, oh, why did they cancel Ash vs. Evil Dead? We just saw an example right in front of you right now. Ash vs. Evil Dead, raise your hand. Stars people. Once again. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. Unbelievable. Oh, where did that show go? Right up into the air. <laughs> You know what? Hey, you slackers out there. Ash vs. Evil Dead is actually one of the most down, illegally downloaded shows. Yeah. Thank you all. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're, we're going to get canceled because you're all loyal criminals. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. Sir, with your fancy uh, Hawaiian shirt, what brand is it? I don't know. I like it. Dude, behind the dude, look at look. Go like that. Go like that. Mike, Mike, go go check it out. My buddy Mike. Here. Batik Bay. Oh boy. Yeah. Hey, who's got a Hawaiian shirt here on tonight? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. If the pattern doesn't go across the buttons, you have a shitty shirt. <laughs> Sam Max, bring notice. Seven years. Seven years, so seven years, the pattern not only goes across the buttons, it goes across the pocket. You got two things right there. Jack and shit and Jack left town. Uh, sir, why do you have a, you have a creepy little person on your shoulder right here. <laughs> Who, who are you, sir? Who are you, kid, who doesn't know why he's here? <laughs> why did my father put this um, mesh on my head? <laughs> sir, why are you here? Don't talk to your child. Your child won't answer because he's too stupefied, but he does have a, a severed hand of some sort that his father made him wear. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, oh my god. Dear child, when you go home, just read like a like a Hardy Boys book or something. <laughs> Life magazine. Don't don't worry about it. Your father's a low. <laughs> uh, you're not recording, right? You you don't have a question, you're just recording. You're recording your non question. Yes, sir, right here. Yes. Dude, I I need to know. How did you get that scar right here? Really? How did I get my scar right there? Does anyone have my first book? <laughs> all right, all right, all right. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no, I just want you to know what a ridiculous question that was. <laughs> Okay, just so you know, this is page one. This is page one. Page one of the first book, 15 years ago. 
Yeah. Yeah. You were, how old are you, sir? 23. 23. Minus 15. You were jack shit back then. <laughs> <laughs> the first paragraph of my book. There is an L-shaped scar on the left side of my chin. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you want to find out? Buy the fucking book. Yes, sir. Uh, huge fan, Bruce. And I just, yeah. I, <laughs> I want to know, are we ever going to see you with Bubba Hotep ever again? Bubba Hotep ever again. No, 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 no. No, no and it's okay. Some stuff does not have to be uh, derivative forever. Because guess what's going to happen? I'm going to write the review right now of Bubba 2. Nice try. <laughs> and then where are you? I'm still going to be happy. No, you're me. Oh. You're me right now. You made that movie. Nice try. What's your name? Aaron. Aaron. Nice try, Aaron. Nice try. First one was a classic. It was. Yeah, nice try, Aaron. And your whole life is nice try, Aaron. You're like an Olympic medalist. Olympic medalists, they, they, they do the ice capades. And now, Olympic medalists. They don't say what medal. You know what is it? If you don't get a gold, they say Olympic medalists. They don't say silver medalists, do they? Do they, Cameron? No. So, sir, that's why. That's why, sir. Yes, back here. How much of Ash was inspired by me? Yeah. Hopefully not very much, sir. <laughs> Ash is a dummy. Oh, now you have it all figured out, do you? <laughs> is that me saying, hey, I need to be getting this character more like me? Hey! No, sir. It's an evolving thing. Working with the great Sam Raimi. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, of all the stuff that Sam Raimi has made me do. Wait, go back, go, go back. Wait. What was the second half of your long-winded question? What stunt has pissed you off the most? That Sam Raimi has done that has pissed you off the most. So much. What stunt made me piss me off the most? Yeah. Uh, stuff that Sam didn't make me do. Uh, season two, Ash vs. Evil Dead, Ash. Uh, pulled up the butt of a cadaver. <laughs> That's about it right there, sir. A box checked. Head up the butt. Head up the butt. Let's go way in the back where the awesome questions are. Wait. Wait, hold on. No, no, guy who has Ash vs. Evil Dead giant promo piece. <laughs> Because we respect those guys who are so crazy, they carry giant shit around with them. Yes, sir. What's your question? Oh my God, giant ash! Wow. Wow. So who's crazier, uh, book guy or? Uh... Let's go, book guy. Book guy. What's your question, book guy? Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm freaked out. How are you? <laughs> and you're ass tonight too. Well, then it's a it's a push, as they say in the gambling industry. You're freaked out, so am I. We're both freaked out. It's a push. There's no problem anymore. Yes, uh, promo guy. <laughs> promo, sorry. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. Promo person. Promo girl. Promo person. What was your question? Uh, where, where did you get that thing, first of all? Uh, my friends worked for stars, and they said Your friends worked for stars, and they were giving that shit away. <laughs> yeah, cool. Great. Okay. So, um, I actually wrote an interview for our show, Circus of Chaos. You wrote an interview for a show, Circus of... Yes, that you... Circus of Chaos. Yeah, the interview. All right. Yeah.
The downtime it takes to take off the blood, yes. There's the time that puts on the blood, the time it takes to take off the blood. And where are we, do we have a question tonight? Do we have a... I asked for a personal sponge bather. I did not, ma'am. <laughs> no, nope, nope. In this uh, era of uh, potential harassment, nope, nope. <laughs> nope, no, no hand on my penis has been requested tonight. <laughs> nope. Yes, sir. You you cannot put your hand on my penis tonight. <laughs> so, so um... unless it's with a, a joint of marijuana in the back parking lot after the show. <laughs> Put your hand on my feet. <laughs> Welcome to Sacramento. Anyway, Lisa has a mace, sir. Yes, sir. So my question is just, how do you keep doing it? I mean, keep doing what, sir? What do I do, sir? Being amazing. Being amazing. Um, all the stuff. I can't define that, sir. That's your. Uh, why is this guy, sir? Are you on a table back there? Yes. Are you? Are you in a dangerous position? Okay. Nice. I work for Barnes and Noble. I work for Barnes and Noble. Yes. Get off the fucking table, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Corporate situation. Yes, sir, right here. What was it like working with Ossie Davis? Like working with Ossie Davis on uh, Bubba Hotep, the great Ossie Davis? Yes. Uh, like you would think it would be. <laughs> Very classy guy. Ossie Davis gave the eulogy of Malcolm X. What what the hell? How do you even talk to a guy like that? Yeah. Who historically, culturally has so much gravitas, you go, I'm just a bullshit artist compared to this guy. <laughs> I mean, seriously. First day of shooting, I said, Ozzy Davis, I know why I'm in Bubba Hotel. Why are you in Bubba Hotel? He said, my grandchildren like people dead. So God bless you. God bless you, the grandchildren of Ozzy Davis. <laughs> Saying, Grandpa, do this movie. It's okay. <laughs> so, yeah, crazy. Second to last movie. He died like one and a half movies later. Classy guy, though. Mega class. Thank you, Bruce. Yeah. Yes, sir. What is the next feature you are going to direct? What is the next feature I'm going to direct? Uh, when you find out, sir, please let me know. <laughs> I'm waiting for Ash vs. Evil Dead to run its course, season three. Four or beyond. Uh, yeah. But because you are not downloading enough of Ash vs. Evil Dead. By the way. Bring back Boomstick. Bring yeah. back Boomstick. Hey, back hey, boomstick. hey, Boomstick Biatch. <laughs> Go to Stars app. Download the Stars app. For how much? Hey, people in the back, that's a zero. <laughs> zero money. Uh, watch tomorrow. Two seasons of Ash vs. Evil Dead. Or people in the back. Zero. zero. <laughs> Delete the app. Now you're cool again. <laughs> I'm sorry it's so hard for you people to find Ash vs. Evil Dead. <clears throat> Two more questions and we'll get to signing your crap. Yes, sir. <laughs> Do you have any more plans for writing a book like Make a Love to Bruce Campbell Way? Do I have more plans for writing a book like Make Love to Bruce Campbell Way? <laughs> uh, no, because that book has already been written. <laughs> Unless you're like a sequel to that yes. book. Sequel, yes. sequel, 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 more sequel. More fiction. more fiction is coming, I can guarantee you that. Yeah. Because I'll tell you what, when you make a movie, there's a lot of chefs. You make a movie that's $100 million, there's a lot of people who have opinions. You write a book, there's like one and a half people who go, yeah, how about this? You go, yeah, I'm good. Yes, back there. Yes, sir. So what is it like working with Seth Green on Robot Chicken? Seth Green and Robot Chicken, I have never met him. Because that's how it works sometimes. You record stuff at different times and it's not special like you think it is. <laughs> Sorry, sir. It's fake. It's all fake. I yes, a, uh, blood from your wrist tattoo. I have a... Uh, right? Has from... your wrist been reattached? <laughs> a little bit. A little bit. Partially attached. Partially attached. 
You're like a, a rancher off the five freeway. <laughs> you ever see that trailer? Up the five freeway? Yeah. There's a severed hand. He bled for you. He died for you. Are you, is that, are you the rancher off the five freeway? It's around, it's around Reddit, near Reddit. Oh, hey. Right? You know what I'm talking about. Are you that guy? All right, anyway, sorry, sir, yes. A text from Dana, she says... Uh, a text from who? Dana DiLorenzo. Dana DiLorenzo, who plays uh, Kelly from yeah. Master of yeah. the Day. And what does what she, she need says, to know? She uh, says she got you a gift certificate to uh, Buca de Beppo. Come get Buca de Beppo. Uh, <laughs> uh, has anyone been to Buca de Beppo? Yeah. 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 Yeah, Dana DiLorenzo is actually Italian, and she hates that restaurant chain yep. uh, to the core of her being. Yep. So whenever, whenever I'm near one, I take a picture of me, and, <laughs> her, and I send it to her, and I go, wow. Yeah, so if you ever want to, by the way, do, do this, seriously, do this. Like, immediately. Dana Dealer at Dana De Lorenzo bullshit Twitter whatever <laughs> I'm so famous at Twitter <laughs> and do that find every book book and a pepo photograph of every city <laughs> restaurant and send it to her and go and but but say this wow period <laughs> just ate here period <laughs> I know that you're Italian <laughs> And that you would appreciate authentic Italian. <laughs> oh my, OMG, OMG, period. It's so authentic. Hashtag, hashtag is so authentic. <laughs> yeah, so punish her right back immediately as soon as you can. Thank you. Anyway, all right. Um, I think we're going to finally sign some stuff tonight. <laughs> My buddy Mike here. Come on up here, Mike. He's going to explain some stuff. I'll see you in a few minutes. Thanks for coming. Woo!